Photosynthesis is the process plants use to make their own food. The word means building with light. It's a fundamental process that sustains life on Earth by creating food for almost all living things and producing the oxygen we need to breathe. Without it, life as we know it wouldn't exist. This process has been shaping our atmosphere for billions of years. Plants need four key ingredients for photosynthesis, just like a chef needs ingredients for a recipe. The first is sunlight, the main source of energy that drives the whole process. The second is water, which is absorbed from the soil through the roots and transported up the stem to the leaves. The third is carbon dioxide, a gas that plants take from the air through tiny pores in their leaves called stomata. This is the same gas that humans and animals exhale. The fourth ingredient is chlorophyll, the green pigment in plants that gives them their color. It acts like a solar panel, capturing the sun's energy to power the chemical reaction. The process occurs inside the plant's leaves. The roots absorb water, which travels up the stem to the leaves. The leaves, positioned to catch sunlight, use chlorophyll to absorb the sun's energy. At the same time, the leaves take in carbon dioxide through the stomata. Inside the leaf cells, the captured solar energy drives a chemical reaction that breaks down water and carbon dioxide molecules and rearranges them into two new products. The chemical reaction produces two vital elements. The first is glucose, a type of sugar that is the plant's food. It provides energy for growth, repair, and the production of flowers and fruits. Excess glucose can be stored for later use. The second product is oxygen, a byproduct that the plant doesn't need. It's released back into the air through the stomata. This is the oxygen that most animals, including humans, need to survive. Photosynthesis is crucial for several reasons. First, it produces the oxygen in our atmosphere. Every breath we take contains oxygen produced by plants, algae, and phytoplankton. Second, the glucose that plants produce is the base of nearly all food chains. Herbivores eat plants, carnivores eat herbivores, and humans consume both. The energy in our food originally comes from the sun, captured through photosynthesis. Third, plants act as sponges for carbon dioxide, a greenhouse gas. By absorbing CO2, they help regulate Earth's temperature and combat climate change. Credits, based on the video photosynthesis, how it works and what it is.